this is a brief demo of how I use Trello to track stuff that I'm doing. So, main things would be a to-do list for today. So, I've made this up just now. I'm not using my real one. Um, mow the lawn, feed the cat, stroke the dog, drink some green juice. So, if you want to say I need to do something else, like, I don't know, uh, read face, Facebook. Boom. Now, there's things that we're going to be doing today. Uh, keep a list of what we done tomorrow. So I think oh, I don't really fancy green juice today. Just move it across. Uh, when I read Facebook, I can claim that I've done it. You know, my real to-do list and done list. There'll be a huge load of uh, columns of stuff here. A, B, C, D. Loads of stuff that I've done in previous weeks. G, H, and so on. Um. What I find useful is the night before, I will decide what I'm doing today. And then I can work my way through those when I've mowed the lawn. Put it over there, mowed the lawn, great. Um, if there's something I don't fancy doing even this week, it has to be done at some point. Um, no, I really don't fancy that green juice. Put that over, do that next week. As we approach the end of the week, then the this week should end up... I mean, tomorrow doesn't have to be tomorrow, it could be the day after, really. Uh, the main thing, though, the key part is the to-do today, so that you can keep focused on what you can manage in one day. Don't ask yourself to do too much or you'll get stressed. When it's done, drag it over. The dog hath been stroked. Let's add a card, and this is a complicated thing like, I don't know, uh, sell something on eBay right that's not that straightforward you can make a checklist see checklist add an item so first find item take photo of item research price of item and so on i found my item yay cool let's close that down so now i've got progress now of something that i'm working on sell something on ebay one out of three done um things that Sometimes we have stuff on our to-do list that we just put off forever. Just put them on the someday list. In fact, you can have another list called um, uh, to do never. And that is where you've got something dragging you down that you think you need to do. Maybe you just decide to never do it. You don't need to do it in your life. You just won't do it. So like watch Doctor Who, right? I'm just never going to watch Doctor Who. Uh, as much as I hear it's a good show, I'm just never going to do it. So I've decided now not to watch it. Um, that's basically it, really. But the, the point is that you've got your to-do list here. It's very easy to then track what you've done. You just drag it. You don't really have to consciously make the done list. But the done list will end up being quite useful to you because you can look back and go, wow, look at all the things I've done. I can't believe I've done all these things. It's amazing. Or... Did I do that thing? Oh, check. Oh, yeah, I did stroke the dog. Or, um, what are the reasons? Well, just maintaining this thing kind of keeps you focused, prioritise, you know what you're meant to be doing today, and so on. If something suddenly comes up, don't necessarily put it on today's list, you put it on tomorrow's list, process it then. So, yeah, this system works. This is on web browser, but there's an iOS app. There's probably an Android app and so on. This is Trello. I don't know whether you're really meant to use it for this kind of thing, but I've been using it for 24 weeks, so it's working all right for me. Uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.